Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. So today we're going to be checking out the brand new blueprints that you get or the rewards you get uh, if you have Amazon Prime or Prime Gaming. So if you have Prime Gaming, then you're able to log in and get some free stuff for other games. And I'm actually kind of happy because I get a lot of free just like stuff for Call of Duty. They've been doing it for a while now. They finally released a one. I believe this is going to be maybe the final one. Maybe we won't get another season or maybe we will. I don't know. So we'll see. I think there's still about two seasons left for Vanguard before it's all said and done. So we'll have to wait and see. But this one for season three is officially out. And I wanted to show you guys what it is that you get uh, and remind you guys that now is the time to log in claim it over on Prime Gaming uh, so you can use it in game. Now, the annoying thing is that it doesn't give you a notification that you got something new, which kind of sucks. So I'm going to go ahead and show you where you get these guys, which ones they are, just so you are aware where to actually put them in your loadout and how to use them so with that said let's go ahead and jump into it if you enjoyed the video drop a like if you're new make sure to subscribe with notifications on so we don't miss a single upload and if you want to support the channel directly then you can do so by checking out my sponsors control freak and aim controller i use them every single time that i play code ogx series gets you a discount link down below to that or through my amazon influencer page if you guys would much rather do it that way all right so with aim controller like i said the really cool thing is that these are lifetime warranty so if any of the modded parts like the paddles or if you got the hair triggers if any of those break they will pay and they will fix it for you so that i think honestly that's the, the craziest thing now the entire month of june we're gonna have these promos we're gonna have 10 percent off all orders over 49.99 with code og x-rays or uh, and you also get 50 percent off the remap so if you end up getting the remappable buttons on the back you get 50 percent off that and if your order is over 300 say you decide you want to buy two of these you also get a 30 dollar gift card so a lot of incentives for this month check out aim controller and like i said Control freaks are literally the cheapest best investment you can make to protect your controllers protect these sticks from wearing out Get control freaks Kodo GX is also gets you a discount over there But with that said, let's go ahead and jump into it So what exactly are the items you get? So for the actual weapon if you go over to the Cooper carbine It's actually called the Carthage so you guys can see it's kind of got like a gold kind of finish to it uh, As you guys can see over here. So really really cool looks like it's got some kind of weird design on it is it like a spear or like a snake or i don't know what it is but i like it it's a gold cover finish i like a little bit of kind of rusty kind of look on the optics so a decent looking weapon in my opinion it also has like some leather on it that's actually kind of nice like a little leather finish on it so let's talk about the attachments that it comes with it comes with the g28 compensator for recoil control the ragdoll g45 for bullet velocity and range and recoil control we got the m19 four time optical flip now this one looks like it flips between 1.5 and four time optic zoom so that kind of works out i was going to swap that out but if it can do 1.5 why not we got the cooper 45 rs 45 rs for initial recoil ADS speed and recoil recovery. We're using a vital here for the proficiency Defender for the perk this one I'm gonna swap just over to fully loaded because it makes no change. Uh, we got rubber grip for recoil control We got the 60 round drum that has uh, recoil control fire rate ADS speed magazine capacity at the cost of bullet penetration uh, Reload quickness bullet velocity and range and also damage So this one kind of I think it Balances itself out because it does give you a increased fire rate. So that kind of works out Incendiary ammo. I'm gonna go with subsonic. We're just gonna swap that out. There's no point uh, Then a carver foregrip. So most of the stuff that affects the movement of it will keep the same The only thing we're changing out subsonic to stay off the map and putting fully loaded so we can have more ammo So there we go. I think this is gonna be a cool little combo there now The other things that you do actually get you also get an operator skin. I believe this one is for uh, Where where are you my friend? Uh, no We'll find you eventually we will find you where are you? Uh, there we go it is for Constancy, <laughs> but this one is called the Under Oath, which let's see, where are you? Right over here. And this one's called the Under Oath. So you guys can see, slap it on, and we're going to go ahead and also use her. So you can see this, it actually looks cool. So uh, you know what? I'm actually going to 
put this on here so you guys can see a little bit kind of closer what this outfit looks like. Um, pretty cool. Pretty nice. It's got like a little bit of gold trimmings on it. It's got a little handkerchief just kind of covering it all up. So pretty, pretty cool. The next item that you get, I believe, are like just like a weapon charm. So we'll slap that on just to have it on there. <laughs> but uh, I believe it's what's it called? It's called the heroic hoplite which is this one okay and then we also get the we also get a special emblem i'm trying i'm trying to get through all of these i accidentally cut off what it was <laughs> but it'll 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 be there okay it'll be there uh let's see customization this is gonna be the emblem and i believe what's it called it's like a it's like a soldier tap looking one where are you oh here it is it's this one the bronzed gladiator boom all right so if i remember correctly the last one was a kill cam theme uh which i'm trying to remember which one it is it might be heralded i think it's this one i think this one fits it so we'll just slap it on i usually don't like using anything because i feel like they're too big but you can slap that guy on there so with that said let's check out how this weapon performs in game i'm pumped let's do it all right let's take a look at it boys Eh, actually looks kind of nice. Looks pretty dope. So. <laughs> I definitely think that this is more of a... Use from a distance weapon because up close, I'm getting... Freaking clapped, bro. Like, no Vaseline. It is... It is rough out here. Uh, everyone else seems to have like the fastest time to kill weapon I've ever seen in my life and um, I don't so Jesus case in point Definitely think That this is a weapon you want to use at a distance <laughs> If you could actually see. Hey, yay, yay, yay. Danger, danger, Rangers. Come on. <laughs> okay. Uh, I was going to say, this is not a. It's just not a very good weapon, you know? Okay. Oh, well, I hurt myself. And no. <laughs> I swapped my field of view to independent on the scope just so I could see clearer. And, um... It worked, for sure. But, uh... Oh, man. Should have backed up more. What? This dude was in our spawn? <laughs> My god. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. <laughs> oh, wow. When did I die to the strafe? Yep. That's what I'm talking about. Oh my god. No. <laughs> couple of dudes over there I, f I feel like this thing is not very good at or at least this this attachment setup is not really good unless you're like at a pretty far distance because like anywhere like mid-range you're like you're getting clapped you're like you're getting it you're getting it baby oh my god I, I can't get any kind of momentum going. 
with this setup here, but it, it is what it is. Oh my god. <laughs> I feel like I'd enjoy this weapon more in hardcore. But definitely, um... That's right, destroy. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Oh my god. Pop some shots, popping bottles in the club! Wow. <laughs> Bro! Jesus Christ. So, uh, this is a nice looking blueprint, but it's not. This ain't it. Uh, this attachment combination is like ass. It's, uh, it's pretty bad. You're getting outgunned by literally everyone. Um, so that kind of sucks. Dude. Holy crap. It is terrible. Bro. Bro. It's an aesthetically pleasing, a terrible weapon. Jesus Christ. Look how fast I die to people, and then look how long it takes me to kill people. It's... It's kind of ridiculous. Jeez. Yup. My god. My god. No, you little bastards. <laughs> oh man, this is a this is a hardcore weapon. What I'm gonna say that's that's it. This is a hardcore weapon through and through. If you care about the aesthetics, wow, then uh, use this thing only in hardcore. Turning it around. We changed the scope. You're dead. Gotcha. Oh, wow. We're turning it around, baby. Final 50 seconds of the game. Oh, hey. <laughs> Jesus, I just took that that beating okay yep get your dogs out of here bruh <laughs> oh, man I'm just so used to being like oh hell just like rushing, 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 that this concept of stay back and kind of chill, uh, ha -ha, stuck you little bastard, is kind of foreign now, you know? <laughs> I 
I mean, at longer ranges, it's pretty decent. But, uh, God damn. <laughs> We're starting to come back though. We're starting to come back. Gotcha. A little headache right there. Give you, give you a headache. Got him. Countered him. Jesus, dude. Holy crap. Wow. This is like a... Coming back, baby. We're coming back. Wow. Wow. I, uh, I am kind of devastated at what I am seeing right here. <laughs> yeah. Don't rush with this thing. If you're planning on rushing, this is not it. This is more of a medium to large map blueprint. I feel like it'll really dominate that range, but definitely not a ship house map. But other than that, it looks pretty nice. It's a nice looking blueprint. It has like no recoil. It just is not the fastest time to kill at the close range mark. I'm sure that if you use this thing on a bigger map, it's going to be a really fun weapon to use or use it in hardcore if you really want to keep the aesthetic, but also not get destroyed. So thank you guys so much for watching the video. Hopefully you guys found the video informative, helpful and entertaining. If you did drop a like, if you're new, make sure to subscribe with notifications on so you don't miss a single of a video. And if you want to support the channel directly, then you can do so by checking out my sponsors, Control Freak Aim Controller. I use them every single time that I play. Code OGX gets you a discount link down below to that or through my Amazon influencer page. So give me a follow over on Twitter at OGX if you guys want to talk, interact, see what I'm up to, or if you just want to say, hey, but I'll see you guys next time. I'm out. Peace.